What? That just happened. Welcome back, Toy Hunters, to another episode of Toy Jizz, where we go nuts <laughs> all over Hot Wheels and other die-cast model cars, action figures, and the coolest collectibles. Today, we're going on kind of our secondary route. We're hitting up a bigger Walmart. We're hitting up some Dollar Generals. A spoiler alert, the big news is we find not one, but two, count them, two Cyberpunk Porsches. Without any further ado, let's go ahead and get on into it. We are starting out at a Dollar General, and, um, you know, there's an interspersing of cars here. I think you can tell at a glance that it's already been kind of gone through. This isn't like, hey, this is just dropped or anything like that. We'll kind of give her a flip through for you guys, but, uh, you know, we're not expecting anything really at all um hey guys while i'm thinking about it don't forget to like comment and subscribe to humane garbage if you like this video and want to see more of them hey here's some of the uh matchbox and some of these uh eh. there's nothing there's nothing blowing my skirt up here it's kind of whatever Here's a, uh, a van, a bus or something, like a short bus. I don't think I need that. No thanks. And here we are now at a Wally World dump bin, and oh, hey, hey now, I think it's my first, uh, Zamek? Uh, one of the E Mustangs? I mean, huh, I don't know how to feel about that. No soup for you! There's the Ford, uh, GT, you know, it's kind of a supercar, um, uh, there's the, uh, the van, the 90s van or whatever, the Toyota, I think is what it is. Um, you know, hey, I'm, I'm always kind of late to the party on all this stuff. Hey, I've got a lot of distance between these places. There's another one of the Ford GTs. Hey, um, is that like two of them? There's a third. And there's one of the kind of older style of them, the white one. Um, anyway, the supercars, they all just look the same, you know? And I get it from a basically engineering standpoint, kind of a build standpoint, and probably also a, um, you know, computer drafting software standpoint. Um, but they just, uh, they just all look interchangeable to me. Uh, No soup for you. <clears throat> Not as though I'm ever gonna get to buy one, anyway. Like it really fucking matters what my opinion is on them. But uh, yeah, as you can tell here, guys, we're gonna go through them a little bit. But there's nothing that um, you know, it's been gone through. There's nothing that great. In Ooh, and a second, a second uh, Zamic. Uh, okay, interesting. I'll probably grab it just because it's a Zamic. You know, um, you know, hey, shout, shout out, uh, at least I got some Xamex, finally. Now, this is a second, um, bin dump bin I guess uh, now here's kind of their regular section and a dump bin here as well um, oh, the Devincinator and nope still not buying it there's the uh, Mazda I may end up picking up one of those I do kind of like it but it's whatever
Another one. kind of go through these pegs just a little bit but you can all you can already tell just from what's showing um and you know all these bully goats um yeah um there's one of the hondas and uh i even got a buddy that's going ape shit for those i couldn't give a fuck about hondas sorry not sorry i just i don't i don't care Here's some uh, Matchbox 5 packs. Here's a few of the Cat Choker Jurassic Park cars. They've been pretty well gone over. Basically, people wanted the nostalgia stuff, the Jeep and the Exploder. Um, now, here's their uh, premium section. And uh, here's some... Uh, of the M2s and Jadas and Fast and the Furious. Some of the bigger stuff. Yeah, that's definitely in the wrong spot. Those look pretty well gone through. Some sort of Mitsubishi. I couldn't really care. An Alfa Romeo, kinda ugly. As far as I'm concerned. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, shit! Two of them. Yeah, boy! Here's the Jurassic Park cars. You never see these moving. No, nope, nobody wanted them. They make so many cars, and I wonder if it's hey they're trying things out, and it's and it's just whatever. Um, but they make so many cars, just nobody fucking wants, dude. You know those Jurassic World cars, nobody fucking wants them, dude. They they're just sitting there. They're peg warmers. They're they're garbage to try out, I guess. But they're, they're just not even worth fucking buying. As far as I'm concerned, they're ugly. Here's some character cars. No, thank you. And now, now check out the uh, the tech decks and the Hot Wheel skates. And here, right here up front, even check that out is a uh, treasure hunt. Uh, I'll be honest with you. Now, I've looked at these a little bit before, and I'm still looking now. Um, the treasure hunts on these aren't that rare, obviously. Um, you can tell, hey, they want people to buy those shits, uh, but they're three bucks a shot. It's just, uh, who cares? Um, we're at another uh, Dollar General. And, uh, now some of these ain't too bad of looking. Uh, we may... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Man down. Um, we may actually, um, luck out here. Um, some of these kind of look a little bit, you know, new. Eh, you know, on second kind of glance here, they sure got these sticking out. We may have had a restock, uh, but my guess is um, this has already been gone through at least a little bit. And um, anything of quote-unquote value here is already gone. Yeah, I did the same thing because I have to 
Plenty, plenty of Batmobiles, man. Um, still, I don't know what they were thinking on the brown Batmobile, still. But, God, you never see those moving, man. Why would you? That's kind of all we got at a... Eh. Maybe there's some other stuff. There's a few cars up there. Uh, character cars and the premium Batmans. They don't even look attempting to get... The Sky uh, Busters. You know, if I was a little kid, I'd probably be more into those. But, uh, you know, me at this age and the collectability of it, nah, it's not really what I'm looking for. We've moved on to yet another Dollar General and take a look at these pegs again. Uh, they're not looking too shabby from the outset. They may have gotten some new stuff. Um, let's give her a whirl. Pink gasser up front. Eh, not a great sign, but it is what it is. There's, there's so many of these cars. It's like, hey, um... It's not for me, but, like, somebody else should buy this, right? Somebody needs to hashtag clear the pegs, right? Like, uh, but, you know. You know, I, I, it's just like, you think you think they'd try to make, you know, hey, they've got 250 in a set, 250 a year coming out, whatever. You think they would try to make as many of those kind of as hey, collectible, hey, it's something people want as much as possible instead of, you know, brown Batmobiles. Another, you know, another brown Batmobile. Um, it's just, what, what are you... What's the point? What's the reasoning behind making cars that nobody fucking wants, man? I don't get it. Sometimes, I know this isn't a super. I think it's the blue ones that can be the super. Sometimes I do that just for the hell of it. Just to make sure.
last one. Hey, a lot of times I don't like Miatas, but I kind of, I kind of like that little Miata right there, the black one. A lot of times I don't like black cars either, but um, the gold wheels with the black car, kind of, kind of like it. But uh, I still think I'm gonna just skip over it. Uh, anyway, guys, that's all we've got for this trip. Um, as you already saw, the big news was is we got not one but two right in a row Cyberpunk Porsches. Um, so I got that going for me, which is nice. Um, anyway, guys, that's all we got for you this time. If this is your first time watching a Humane Garbage video, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell to get notifications of new videos sent directly to your phone and inbox. Follow us on social media and stay tuned for another video from Humane Garbage. <laughs>